Hey! What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Blackburger, aka Mr. Sexy, or whatever you want to call it. And I got something new for you guys. I personally haven't seen this. I'm very excited to unveil this. I've been planning this out for a couple of weeks now. Um, and I hope you guys like it. So what it's gonna be is... The value player of the week for week one. So this week's value player is gonna be... <laughs> Mr. Strong Chris Long. Chris Long is a defensive end for the St. Louis Rams, and his value right now currently is 1,600 coins. That's what makes him this week's value player of the week. This guy has amazing stats that make him a pass rushing weapon. 88 strength, 73 speed, 82 acceleration, which you really need, 80 awareness, a bunch of useless, unimportant stats, 86 jumping. 66 tackles a little down, hit power is a little down, but 91 power moves and 74 block shedding, 75 pursuit, which makes him a defensive end beast. I played with him for a couple of games and wanted to really find out how he played. For 1,600 coins, he was an absolute destructive beast. As you can see, this guy was just beating up on poor Aaron Rodgers. I didn't keep an accurate tab, but he had got about 10 to 15 sacks. Uh, not only on Aaron Rodgers and the couple of games I played with him, I wanted to make sure that he was a valuable player. And one of the things that really set him aside was the fact that he was running after the run block. So he was getting blocked up and then he would still run to go get his man. By just clicking a simple down on the right directional pad, he can have a powerful pass blocking move. And this guy is too strong for his own good. He's fast, he's, he's very quick off the line of scrimmage, and he always finishes. In addition, with the 86 jumping, he can really do some damage when passes are already thrown and he just jumps up and swats it. Personally, he had about three swats in the games I've played with him. Next up, the next player of the week is going to be Mr. Randall Cobb. Yeah, Randall Cobb. Now he's a little pricier, but the dude is a beast. For four to 5,000 coins, he's a little pricey, but his stats really make up for it. He wasn't a big play threat, but he was definitely a guy that catches the ball in the middle and doesn't fail to catch the ball. Unfortunately, he does get injured. I did get him injured once, and that's good enough for, for me in four games. Where he really excels is the yards after catch. This guy's an absolute beast. He has 90 speed, which makes him pretty fast, but not elite speed. But he has great acceleration and agility that really make him a threat and give him the ability to take the ball down the field after catching it. He has 89 catch in traffic, which is pretty good. For 4,000 coins, he's an absolute monster, though. I mean, I played with him for, you know, four games, and I got very good results out of Randall Cobb, and I personally am going to hold on to him for a long time. And for some reason, he has just an amazing nose for the touchdown. He got me like four or five touchdowns within those four or five games, which is absolutely amazing. He did get injured on the last one, like I mentioned before, and it's okay, but I mean... You know, you're taking a four to five thousand dollar hit. I mean, coin hit. Sorry. You might as well invest on a couple of injury contracts. He has mediocre route running stats, which are okay, but you know he does get open a lot. And I was playing on all Madden difficulty against the computer, and all Madden is pretty ridiculous. If you guys have played with all Madden, that shit gets pretty hard. The fact that Chris Long, defensive Valley Player of the Week, was able to sack Aaron Rodgers multiple times, Joe Flacco multiple times, and Tyron Smith because he did get injured after a while, uh, multiple times, means that he's an absolute monster. I would pay upwards of like about 5,000 coins for this guy. Uh, Randall Cobb, I would pay just around the same price, 6,000, 7,000 coins, you know, for Randall Cobb because he's a playmaker, and that's what he is. He's a playmaker. He's not a deep ball threat, but he's a guy that's going to make a first down or a touchdown. Thank you guys for watching this. I hope you guys tune in next week for another Value Player of the Week. I will be doing it as long as I you know get the right amount of views so uh feel free to follow me at twitter at blackburger thank you guys for watching hasta luego